Here's a goodies box for April, even though it's May 2nd, but I got an email saying that they were going to credit us 150 points since they were late. They had an issue with like getting their products to the thing in time. Okay, so this month I don't see a product card in it. We just got this card saying if we want more information about the products um, or if we want to purchase to go to the website. So The Green Giant Multi-Grain Sweet Potato Chips Sea Salt So Green Giant, they make those frozen vegetable things products um, but I didn't know that they made chips. This is probably a new thing. And it comes in sweet potato. We like sweet potatoes. So that's what they look like in the bag. It only comes up to here. That's what it looks like. Oh, the big one. So, they just look like tortilla chips. Um, it kind of has a texture of, um, sun chips, if you've ever had those. Mm hmm And it does taste like sweet potato fries, but in a crispier form. So, mm -hmm. I really liked it. They're good, they're just not my type. A little, need a little bit more salt for me. He, <laughs> I don't think he really likes plain flavored things. A little things. bit more on the plain side. He likes things with, like a lot of flavor but I like simple things and this is good for me so yeah I will be taking these the next thing we got is Angie's um, classic sweet and salty kettle corn Oops. okay <laughs> so, I thought they were kind of plain. Like I said in the other one, I like plain things, but this one is okay. It's not really sweet at all. Not like kettle corn. It's basically just tastes like regular popcorn with slightly sweet. I liked it. I, I thought it wasn't too much, but it was just enough. I thought there was a little bit of sweetness in there. That okay. you liked? I liked it. Hmm. I would eat this since I have it, but I don't think that, you know, I would go out and buy it, so. So next is the True Bar Apricot Almond and Chai or something. But, uh... It yeah. looks scary. Yeah. <laughs> I can see all that dried stuff in there. It's supposed to be good for you. Hmm. Who knows? Let's see. Good source of fiber, non-GMO. Omega-3. It looks like a, like those fruit leathers. I'll just take a little piece. Mm. Yeah, that's all mm. right. <laughs> <laughs> so I like the texture of the almonds in there because they're really crunchy and crisp. And I do like the um, sesame seeds. And the texture of the fruit that's in there is okay. But for me, I don't know. The initial flavor that I get reminds me of soap. It tastes like soap. Soap and cinnamon. I don't like it. Period. <laughs> Point. Done. <laughs> the end. Yeah, that's enough. So the next thing we got is this drink, and this was what was making the box heavy. I think the brand name is Celsius, and it just says burn more calories plus lasting energy. So maybe an energy drink that helps you lose weight. Um, and it is in raspberry 
Akai green tea. So, so and it's good for you. Has no sugar, no high fruit, fructose, corn syrup, none of that. None of Next that is Olomo. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm just saying extra L in there or something. But uh, chai bliss um, uh, almonds. almonds. Something about vanilla I read. Vanilla blossom floating on a something. Or, or, yeah. We'll just try this. What does it say on the back? It says on the back, featured on the cooking channel. It says it's gluten free and but contains nuts and funny. This product has been tested on humans. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Oh, there. This is what it looks like. So for these Olomomo almonds, um, I like it. And it's that soapy flavor, but it's not that bad in this. That that bar tastes like, I guess it's that chai that gives it that flavor. But these ones are not that bad. I actually do like it. Maybe it's fact, Maybe it's because it's almonds. I'm not a big fan of almonds. But they're okay. They're not the worst, but yeah, they're okay. I would eat these for a snack. Because it, it just gives almonds a little, like, kick because it has that sweet, slightly sweet flavor to it. So, yeah, these are good. Okay, the next thing we got is this $50 wine gift card for NakedWines.com. So, let's see what it says on the back. So, I guess... You have to at least purchase a minimum of $51 worth. So that's good. But it does say that shipping is going to be like $10. That's, that's still good. So, yeah. Um, we should go check this out and see what Last they have. is Zone Perfect Chocolate Chip Cookie Dough Protein Bar. Mm. So, have you ever had a Zone Bar? I have not had a Zone Bar. Me neither. But, but. he loves cookie dough mm -hmm. stuff. So, let's see. It looks good, doesn't it? Yep. Kinda. But it's really soft. It could just because the it's so hot yeah. in there. Okay. But usually protein bars and stuff like that I see are like firmer. What is it, taffy? Okay, let's try. Mm. So for this zone perfect. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna eat it all. It's really good it's really good i haven't had a um protein bar that tasted this good mm -hmm. yeah it says great taste and it does taste great they weren't lying yeah it's really soft but that's just probably because it's really warm right now but either way it's still good yeah it just tastes real like the a flavor. candy bar yeah the chocolate chip cookie dough flavor really comes out and it's really good yum 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 <laughs> yeah if I didn't eat dinner right now, I would eat that right now. Mm -hmm. Alright, so this is everything that we got in our April goodies box. There's some really good things in here and some alright and not alright stuff. No. And we'll let you know how that drink goes. Yeah, but my favorite thing in here was this Green Giant Sweet Potato Chips. And this Zone Perfect Energy Bar. Protein Bar. I will agree with the Protein Bar. Protein Bar was delicious. Was there anything that you did not like? Uh, I think we will agree that yeah. this True Bar was disgusting. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe it's just us. Cause if We're you, not fans of uh, dried fruit or... Like, I don't think we like any bars and that... And bars that have like like just chunks of like fruit like that in there. That's just not our type of thing. Yeah, so like, if you watch most of our videos, anytime we get bars like these, we're just not a fan. We just don't like it, so. That's it. So yeah, this box is like one of our favorites, and it is only $7 a month. So if you're looking for a good snack box, I think this is the way to go. You should check them out. Okay? And that's it.